welcome to Port Orleans here in Walt Disney World, where I am staying for the night and I will show you around the hotel. I just showed you where we are going to have some lunch before we start our day. So join me on this adventure. Good morning from the Port Orleans. I didn't record a whole lot yesterday because I was in the moment having fun on our Tiki monorail crawl. We ended up at the Polynesian, but I wanted to show you the room, which I did promise, which I will do after we have breakfast. I'm having a craving for some Mickey waffles. So we're going back to the same place we went yesterday where they really have a good selection of food and um, show you around this place a little bit more before I head home. You're so pretty. As promised, I am giving you a tour of my room. This is our view. We are on the first floor and we just have a standard room. It's perfectly fine. And it's close to the parking uh, area. So, and that's where they pick you up and drop you off for a uh, lift. We used the lift yesterday. Okay, so coming back to the entrance. This is the entrance. There is a table. There's two chairs. I have one over here that I moved. And there's two queen beds, super duper comfortable. I slept really well last night. I had four pillows, uh, so that was really nice. Um, you know, it's got your New Orleans type of decor here. It really reminds me of the pop century, except it's just decorated differently. I'm sure there's probably a refrigerator in here. Didn't even look last night. We were not in the room really except to sleep. Yeah, there's a refrigerator and it makes it looks like it's part of the decor. There are some drawers. If you are staying here longer than just a night, there's three drawers for you to use. Um, they have an ice maker. They do have a coffee maker. I moved it to the other side because we were making hot tea. They do have a lovely television. Uh, this seems to be in all of the rooms across uh, Walt Disney World where you can hang coats and hats and things. Uh, this is for your luggage. At first I thought it was just a bench, but they don't have a luggage actual rack that I normally use. So I've been using this for my luggage rack and my brother fit his stuff there. So it worked out great. This is the bathroom area. Once again, as if you looked at my video from Pop Century, same thing. It's got a privacy. So if someone's sleeping, the other person wants to get ready, you can close that and keep it separate. The sink area, we've got two sinks. This is the coffee maker. It's just a simple coffee maker. Um, make one or two cups. I just made hot water with it because they do give you tea bags. Just your standard sink an area to hang your things. There is a safe if you wanna leave things in your safe. That's right here. They do have extra pillows and blankets as they always do, and iron. And then this bathroom, oh, they do have a full length mirror. Hey, hi, how you doing? This one has a tub. So if you have kids, this is a good place to stay because there is a tub. Uh, the shower was really nice. It has um, like the rain head that I really enjoy. It's pretty, it's got nice tile in here. And of course, they don't give you the little soaps like they used to, but they do have the Disney brand of H2O, which does smell quite nice. A little ledge there, so if you are a parent, you could sit on a ledge, you know, with your feet in the tub and, and wash your, your babies. And yeah, it was very nice. Uh, towels, plenty of towels in this place. This is a moderately priced resort. And then I'm gonna be off to the Magic Kingdom. And it's just, it's a really nice place to stay, so. That's my review of this place. And the food was really good. Those Mickey waffles were super delicious. tip for you if you did not know these uh, shooting gallery which used to cost money to play here at Frontierland at the Magic Kingdom is absolutely free so I have not done this I don't think since I was a kid so I'm gonna go see how bad I am at it and I'm gonna leave you with that so thank you for tuning into the wonderful world of Wendy don't forget to hit the subscribe button below it's getting very loud <laughs> give me a big thumbs up and I'll see you on my next adventure